Hey everyone, Witzer here. So we got some new monsters in Lost Realm. So let's see how good or bad they are. It's gonna be fun. I'm gonna try a few different setups. First, I'm gonna fight with my strongest setup and then I will just mix it up. As you can see, he, we have a Revenant. They are all double evolved, so they are not that easy to kill, I think. Plus they cost 18 stamina, which is a lot. This is a really strong team of me with Demogorgon and Medusa. I know not everybody has Demogorgon or Medusa with 5 Revite, so I'm gonna do some different setups in the end of the video. So as you can see, we get we got 260 red crystals, which is a lot. Here we are fighting against a Michael with a Demogorgon and a little Nick, which is not bad, I think. So it's definitely not an easy team to kill. Misses all over the place. So as you can see, my heroes are taking a lot of damage, but we got to win. But this team of me is really strong, so it doesn't really count. So here we have... Oh, not here. Okay, here we have another Demogorgon team, so let's see. As you can see, they are all level 170. I'm not sure if the level will go up if you increase your level in Lost Realm. I'm really not sure. Against the Michael. The Michael is doing a lot of damage. Yeah, this is not an easy fight. We lost some heroes. Also, you get rare crest boxes too, which is really nice. So here we are fighting Lady Liu with a Grim. As you can see, there's a tons of new heroes inside, which is really cool. So these are level 150, so it's it's gonna change often, I guess. So let's see how this team is gonna do. Looks like they didn't give Lady Leo 5 revites. Kinda wish they did to make it even harder. We got one crest box, 250 red crystals. Here we have a revenant. Medusa. Wow, this also is not a bad team, but should be beatable. 160. Malt has 5 revite, so that's not too bad. In a few fights, I will change my setup. Just gonna show you some different setups of the Lost Realm fights we are facing. So here we are fighting against the Pixie. It took me quite a while to find all these battles because it's pretty rare to find them, I think. Takes a while. Here we go. As you can see, my heroes are actually taking damage. I think we even lost one once again. Okay, so here we go. This will be the next one. Let's open this real fast. Okay, so let's see. Against a little Nick. What else is inside? A Demogorgon and Ares. So I'm just gonna change my team right here to actually see if it's possible killing this with random team. So I'm gonna pick some heroes that most of the people have. So an Ares and a Cupid. A Dreadrake I think most people have. So also gonna put a Ghulam out there and a Michael. Not sure if too many people have a Michael, but let's see. So this is a different setup against a Demogorgon team. So they are missing like crazy. Not sure what's happening right here. Looks like we are winning because of the Michael. But pretty sure we took some losses. Yeah, we have three heroes left. So we two of them died. So that says a lot about the team we are facing. Here we are going to fight a Dreadrake. So with a Malt and Medusa, Trixie and Revenant. So let's see. Gonna change my team once again. Let's make it interesting. Gonna change team two. So let's change Michael for... Hmm, who should we pick? I guess we can change it up with Trixie, but Trixie is really strong. So, so let's see. Trixie against Trixie. His Trixie doesn't have 5 revites. The same story with the Lady Leo. 
wish they actually made it five revites. Looks like we took some damage, not too much. Now Trixie procked and it should be game over. So I'm just gonna remove Trixie in the next battle. So what do we have here? A Michael team with Demogorgon. 18 stamina is, I think it's really expensive, so you should actually win the battles. Okay, let's see what we are gonna change. So we're gonna take out Trixie Treat and put in what I guess we can put in Skull Knight since a lot of people have Skull Knight. So we're gonna put Skull Knight in front with Ghoulum behind for some healings. So let's see what's how this is gonna go. Pretty happy I saved some stamina cards to test this out. Here we go. Looks like we are taking tons of damage because of the damn Demogorgon. Looks like we are losing right now. Ghoulum is luckily still alive. Ooh, Ghoulum is about to die. Think we have still Skull Knight left. Yeah, Skull Knight is still alive. Ooh, this is gonna be close. Yeah, there we go. Skull Knight is killing them. Ooh, he might actually die. Let's hope Demogorgon is not able to proc. My Skull Knight has 5 of 5 corrode. So, ooh, look at his health. Wow, this was close. I really wonder how much health we have left. Maybe 1%? So this is how tough it actually is. So here we are going to fight a Medusa team once again. So, should we change it up a little bit? I guess we can fight with this team. Let's try it out. This should be easier. So, Multanica just didn't proc, I think. Hmm. Not sure what to think of this. As you can see, they're staying alive for a really long time. This is really fun, I think. Hope they're gonna add more of these monsters really soon. And maybe make them level 200. I'm pretty sure a lot of people will struggle against them. My heroes are, most of them are 10 of 10 skills, so that makes it a lot easier for me. So, okay, let's see here, uh, who should we change? I guess we could try another one with this setup. Maybe change, add a pumpkin duke and put the Dreadrake behind. Or we can actually put a Michael, I guess. And Skull Knight, so let's see. This should be pretty okay with if if our pumpkin duke is gonna proc looks like he did now our team is going nuts so once again two crest boxes times two i guess in the end of the video i can open the boxes to see what we actually get from them Okay, so this is a Multanica and Trixie. I think a lot of the teams look the same. So here we are going to try something really fun. So let's try and do it with three heroes. So Michael, Cupid and Ares. So let's see if we can actually beat this team with three heroes. All of these three heroes are 10 of 10 skills. So, no, no, I mean, actually two of them are 10 of 10. Ares is 9 of 10. So it looks like Ares died. Well, he didn't die, but he's really close on health. I have a bad feeling about this because my Michael cannot reach Trixie with the pumpkins. Yeah, Ares died. I guess now it's just gonna be a matter of time before we die. Since we don't really have any area damage. Yeah, Trixie just killed our team. Really cool. So this doesn't, wow, and 200 gems to insta-kill it. So better not do that. 
So let's use Ronan. We all know how good he is. Okay, to save some time, I just set up the team with Ronan. So we have four. Actually, I'm going to use three heroes only. So let's see if we can beat this team. Shouldn't really be too easy, but Ronan is really good. Plus, my Ronan has Scatter. So I know it's not the best talent on Ronan, but it feels pretty useful in some occasions. Looks like we are beating them. Yeah, looks like we won. Okay, so I'm going to open the crest boxes to see what we actually got from them. So I'm going to open the rare ones because I think the regular ones will be pretty useless. So let's see. They are all level 2, which is not too bad. A bunch of war gods, bulwarks. This is really interesting. Another war god. Eh, the Destruct sucks, scatter. And what else do we have? Wish I had some more spots. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you all for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye all.